Convicted on 17 counts of rape and two counts of gross sexual imposition, 41-year-old Michael Workman faces more than 160 years in prison. Today, the Boy Scouts Tecumseh Council confirmed Workman was a Tiger Cub Den leader from September 2013 to early 2014. Cub Scout Troop 45 meets at this church in Blanchester along Center Street. But he was involved in the Boy Scouts and then he was no longer involved in the Boy Scouts. WLWT has also confirmed with Blanchester local schools workmen volunteered as a booster with the marching band during the fall of 2013 and would help move equipment during Friday night football games for the band's halftime performances. According to the superintendent, a background check on workmen found nothing. This was an individual who not only was engaging in opportunistic sex offenses, but was actively pursuing other sex offenses when he could. Um, that makes it more frightening. Because of his contact with other children, Claremont County Assistant Prosecutor Scott O'Reilly says there could be other victims and parents need to be aware. Because of what he's been convicted of, the reality is he's not going to likely have access to children ever again. The Boy Scouts of America released this statement today. It says, in part, any instance of child victimization or abuse is intolerable and unacceptable. And this behavior runs absolutely counter to everything for which the Boy Scouts of America stands. It went on to say, once the Scouts learned of these allegations against workmen, he was immediately asked to leave. We reached out to several parents of Cub Scouts in the area, but no one wanted to comment on camera. Reporting live tonight in Batavia, Emily Wood, WLWT News 5. Emily, thank you. Michael Workman could face up to 162 years in prison. He faces sentencing next month.